the biggest pain in life is the pain of regret. The biggest poison in life is regret. Imagine being older, looking back upon your life. Are you going to be able to look back upon a life that you live to the fullest? Or are you going to look back upon a life thinking, ah, I wish I had, I wish I had lived the life that I wanted, but I regret not having lived it. That is the one thing that keeps me going, that's driving me, that kept me going to transform, to break through my corporate, to live the life that I really want. That is what this video is all about. I'm going to give you some points so that you can live a life without regret. And if you don't know me by now, I'm Rachel Smets and I help people create an escape plan, an escape plan from their corporate, from their nine to five, to live the life that they love, to live the freedom lifestyle that they love because you deserve it. And I don't want you to live a life with regrets. No, life is too short. You only have one life. Make sure also to subscribe to my channel, that red button and the notification bell so you don't miss any of my new videos every single week because I'm giving you the steps to overcome the fear, to take the steps to break through and to live that life that you love. So the biggest poison is the regret, the pain of regret. It's bigger than the pain of change. It's bigger than the pain of fear. And yes, when you break through and you make a big change, there is fears to overcome. There, is, there are challenges. I'm not saying it's easy to break through and transform your life, but the pain of regret is the one you want to avoid. And it's also escaping that pain of regret is the drive and the motivation to keep you going. For me, when I was stuck in corporate, the only thing that I could think of was, I want to have a life of meaning, of fulfillment, a life that I can have the freedom to do what I want, where I want, when I want. I don't want to be stuck to giving my time and my effort to a boss because it doesn't feel meaningful. It doesn't feel fulfilled. And so what drove me was that thought like I don't want to grow old thinking what if I had done it what if I had tried it and here's the thing regret the pain of regret is bigger than the pain of change and if you want to change something in your life if you want to get unstuck you will have to go through that discomfort of change because guess what change is the enemy of comfort you want to change something you will have to cross comfort zones. But the pain of change is less than the pain of regret. The pain of change is less painful than the pain of regret. So take those steps to go out of your comfort bubble so that you can create the change that you want. Look, in your life, we are all going to die. We all have bad days. We will all have great days. You will have good days. You will have bad days, but you will have nothing if you don't take action to change. Nothing happens if you don't change anything. And change doesn't mean climbing the Mount Everest. Change means taking small steps, always small steps. That's why I create with my clients an escape plan. I don't want people to take a leap. I don't want you to jump without a parachute. I don't want you to jump without a plan. No, I want you to have a plan so that you can transition from your corporate into the life that you love by taking small action steps, micro action steps. It's never too late to change. You're never too old to change. It's the excuse that I hear over and over again. I'm too old. I'm not smart enough. I'm not technical enough. I don't know how to do it. Well, you didn't know how to ride a bike, but then you tried it and you figured it out. You didn't know how to drive a car, but you tried it, you figured it out, and now you're doing it on an automatic pilot. You can always figure things out no matter what age. I was 40 and I wanted to break through and break free. And yes, at 40 plus, you have responsibilities, you have bills to pay, you have all of these things to take care of, but it's never too late and I'm never too old. And I had a ton of people, Rachel, are you sure? And, and why don't you stay in your job and it's safe and it's comfortable and you're earning good money and look at all the benefits that you have, but I wasn't fulfilled. It didn't feel meaningful to me. 
And so I had to take steps and I started researching, I started studying, I started the online world. I had no idea about the online world. I had no idea about video and audio and all these technical stuff, but I thought myself, I took a coach, I took a mentor and I studied my butt off and I'm taking steps every day and I'm growing. When I started on YouTube, it was like, Rachel, are you sure there's like millions of videos? Why would you go on YouTube? Well, because I want to inspire people. And if I can inspire and motivate one person, I'm happy and it feels fulfilled. That's why I'm doing it. That's exactly what I'm doing. And it's not about how much money you make but it's about how you make that money. It's not about how much money you make, it's about how you make that money. Are you satisfied with your life? Are you doing what you really love and want to do? If not, it's time to change and it's never too late. It's never too late, you're never too old. I want you to take steps. And if you have a dream and a goal and other people are doing it, if other people can do it, so can you. That's what I thought. If other people are doing it, so can I. And I started by looking at it and searching and taking steps. The biggest pain is regret. Please promise me to commit to take steps to create that life that you love. Write it down below, write in the comments, what is your next step? Tiny micro step so that you can get closer to your dream life. What's the tiniest step? Are you researching something? Are you analyzing something? Are you talking to people? Are you taking a coach? Are you talking to a mentor? Are you talking to people who are doing the or who are living the life that you want to live? Then start talking. Those are micro steps that you can take today. And make sure you check that free um, video that I have, seven steps to get unstuck. I'll put it right down below in the comments, in the description so that you can grab that. And I also have a course, Escape Your 9 to 5, with the entire guide step by step. But I'm, I'm happy to help you, I'm happy to talk to you. So let me know in the comments if you need help, if you need a plan, I'm happy, happy to talk to you and talk you through it. And remember, it's your choice. It's your life, it's your choice. Please, please take your life in your hands and make a step and continue achieving your goal and your dream.